Donald, wake up, bro. We're in deep trouble. What is going on? Who are you guys and what did you do to us? Trump, come on, let's get out of here. We need to run. Obama, pick him up, bro, if he doesn't want to wake up. I know how to wake him up. Trump, wakey, wakey. The McDonald's arrived. McDonald's arrived. McDonald's arrived. Ah, I'm here. I'm here. Leave the nuggets to me. Ah, crap. Why is my head hurting so much? And what is going on? Where are we? Last thing I remember, we were at the White House playing games on Joe's PC. And what is up with these weirdos that are with us? I think that we've been kidnapped, bro. I can't remember much either. Come on, Donald, show them what those hands can do. Watch out, I got this one. Go and deal with the other prick. Take this, you idiot. And Joe, you not remembering much isn't something new to us. The scary thing is that we can't remember things either. This looks like a laboratory or something. Come on, we need to get out of here fast and call for help or something, but I don't even have my phone on me. What the? That thing only has a head and some floating hands. And there is blood all over the floor. This is creeping me out, guys. What did we get ourselves into? I don't know, but we need to find the exit. All right, I've seen more weird stuff than what I've seen on my worst trips after I had sniffing contests with my son Hunter. And this place is also on fire. We woke up right on time. I wonder what they did to us, bro. Personally, I don't feel much different other than being hurt a little bit. What about you guys? What about us? Wait, whoa, I didn't know Michelle was here with us this whole time. Where we get out, bitch, all right? So my leg is hurting, my other leg is hurting, and the other one as well, and then my back, my arms, and my head is hurting, and I'm also starting to get dizzy. I'm hurting so much that I might punch you in the jaw, Biden, so I can relieve some of this pain. How would that help you relieve anything? You know what, whatever, bro, just keep going. Hey, Trump, I won't don't forget what you said about Michelle and whoa, what is going on outside? We need to find the highway. I don't see any car nearby so we can steal it. So our last uh, option back I'm to civilization good. is to get I'm to a, the highway in the hopes that out. somebody will stop to get us to the Yo, city. Donald, did Donald just pass out? Look at him, he's on the ground. Donnie, what are you doing, bro? Oh, get up. Crap, he is indeed out. I guess he wasn't lying when he said that he's hurting everywhere. This isn't real, isn't it? I mean, it can't be. Joe slapped me real quick so I can wake up from this nightmare or even better punch me, just do something. Just wait until Trump realizes it's going to be one long day today, bro. Huh? How did I hear Obama talking if I'm only seeing you, Joe, and me? Wait, no, no, wait, this can't be real. Am I, am I? Wait, no, 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 wait a second, bro. Why am I looking at myself right now, but I am talking? Congrats, Trump. You just got the ultimate N word pass and mine got revoked. Well, I wasn't using it anyways, but please don't, don't abuse it. Seriously, Barack, that is your number one concern right now? that Donald finally has the N-word pass? Not that you two literally swap bodies? The number one concern should be about how we are going to reverse this thing. Who said that we need to reverse it? I love it. I just received the infinite N-word pass. Let's go. All right, Donald, so can you tell us where are we going? Bro, this feels so weird looking at myself driving while I'm sitting in the back in this sweaty, musty ass body, bro. Nah, you're going to regret this, trust me. Where are we going? In the hood. I need to greet my homies. I'm finally accepted in here. Oh my, this was one of my biggest dreams. How should I greet them? Is it the classic, what up my name? Shut up, nah, if you say it, I'll choke you out. I mean, I'll choke myself out. Wait, that sounds weird, just don't do it, Trump. Yeah, Donald, I don't think that it would be wise for you to do such a horrendous thing. Just think about all the times you had the pass and you- Yo, what's good, man? I am Mr. Barack what, Joe? Obama, Joe, the one who it. you voted for. Your one and only favorite president. Well, there isn't much you can do about it now, Obama. Just deal with it. Switching bodies has crazy consequences in this context. Now, come on, Donald. You did your thing. Let's go. Yo, Obama, come here real quick. What you doing in the hood, n Did Michelle kick your ass out of the house again? Uh, no. I just came here to visit, and I realized that all that time I spent in the office, I couldn't get shit done for my n****. So as a fellow n****, I am here to apologize to y'all. I am sorry. Yo, but why your voice sounds kind of off? What is wrong with you? Last time I heard you on TV, you sounded different. Actually, you sound more like Trump, if anything. But yo, don't tell Trump I said this, but his bitch is fire. Suck it, idiot. This is the hood takeover. I am the new leader here. Barack Obama is in here and is standing on business. All right, now you're really getting out of hand. Come on, get in the car and let's get out of here before the police arrive and then we have to Sit explain down, bitch. the unexplainable. You know what? This just turned into a shootout. Boys, get your weapons out. Let's show these degenerates what Obamacare looks like. All right, Trump, you need to chill out. You're damaging my reputation with your actions. Get in the car and let's go before the police and television arrive. Then the narrative that Barack Obama went into an African-American community to destroy it will spread faster than Joe's cheeks when he drops the soap in prison if we end up there after today. Spread my what? Bro, keep your weird thoughts to yourself. Nobody touches me in prison. And if you two stop being so dumb and actually want to go back to that lab to reverse this issue we have, 
Maybe we can get home by tonight and play some Roblox. I actually like it, Barack. I don't know about you, but we're going to be like this for a while, so deal with it. Yo, Joe, what do you mean when you say us too? You idiot, I haven't done one wrong thing ever since I woke up in Donald's body. If I wanted, I could have humiliated him so many times, but guess what? He's the only one who did it so far. It isn't like I just went to his home to take Melania out on a date, making her think that Donald is actually good to her for once and not Trump, abusive. Why, why did we stop? Oh, Barack, I think you've made a mistake. Donald, what are we doing at my house? Donald, no, don't you even think about doing anything remotely close to what I suggested as a joke. Come back right now. I'm sorry, Obama, but I got to admit it. You've oh, done crap. it to yourself at this point. Why did you feel the need to mention doing it? Hi, baby girl, my beautiful Mr. Olympia Queen. How are you doing? Ah, uh, I missed you so much. Obama, what is going on here? Why is Trump and Joe with you? Don't tell me you guys want to spend the night at this house again. Ah, uh, no, they're going to leave in a second. I came here to ask you to come on a date with me. You know that it's been a long time since we spent some time together? Together? Uh, it's been only like a day. And what happened to your voice? You sound like Donald? Hey, Michelle, I know it's weird, but me isn't me. We swapped Don't body. worry about it. It's all in your head. It's me, don't you see? All right, Donnie and Joe, get out of my house, and Michelle, get ready for the date. I gotta go and take a shower. Yeah, we'll make them. Get out of the house already. I hate it when Joe stares at me like that. He's creeping me out. You heard her. Get out. We have a date to get ready for. You're going to regret this, Trump. Trust me. I ain't regretting shit. Get out now. Come on, Joe. Move your old ass out of my new home. I ain't trying to lose any more time. I'm going to call you and tell you how the date went. Wow, bro, you really let him do that? What else can I do, Joe? He's literally in my body. But don't worry, Brody thinks that I can't pull the reverse card on him. We're heading straight to his house so I can snatch Melania out of there to go on a date with me as well. She is so stupid, she won't ask too many questions. Well, this didn't turn out too well, apparently, and I don't think that you guys are gonna swap the bodies back too soon either. Glad that I wasn't affected. Somehow managed to get out of there only with a stronger addiction to ice cream than ever. But anyways, uh, yeah, I have a feeling this is gonna end badly for you two. Maybe even with the Obama Minator getting drawn at some point. All right, here we are. Good thing that this fool had his keys in his pocket. And I don't know if it's because I'm controlling his body, but I have the urge to eat Cheetos and McDonald's like never before. Wait, does that mean that he also has the urge to bomb houses and people now? Oh no, only I could have dealt with that. Trump, what are you doing? You haven't come home in the past three days. And why are you not answering my calls? I've been trying to check if you are all right and you are straight up ignoring me. What is wrong with you? Tell me, where have you been all this time? And what is Joe Biden even doing here? Oh, I am so sorry, sweetheart, but I've been caught up with the work and you know how it gets. I'm very busy and I didn't even get to see your calls in the first place. I'm sorry, but I am here now to ask you to come on a date with me so I can fix it. Will you? Oh, that's, that almost makes me tear up a little bit. This is like what? The first time in five years that you talk nicely to me. You see, I always told you that you can be a gentleman with me. It's all up to you. I'm glad that you changed. Oh yeah, you're right. Hold up a second, I forgot that I'm Donald Trump. Hey bitch, get to doing the dishes and be ready. I'm taking you out on a date. I was about to say to try and act a little bit more like him. Wow, what a beautiful setting, isn't it? Tell me when was the last time you've been on a date so well put together like this one? I know that you like surprises. I do. That's why you're the only one who knows me so better. I gotta say, Obama, I don't know what you've been up to lately, but we need at least five more million dollars stolen from the government through Joe so we can buy more houses on other islands. I'm tired of the 32 islands we already have. 32? Oh my, yeah, sure, sweetie. Uh, but can you remind me by any chance how much did we manage to steal so far having Joe as a president? And another question I had, I don't know why, but I forgot how exactly Joe managed to win the campaign in 2020. I mean, I know he rigged the elections. Next time you start talking nonsense, I'll have to give you more than one body shot. You know the saying, two punches in the gut makes a bitch wanna shut up. Now let me give you the night of your life. This date will be something that you won't forget for the rest of your life. That's how special it's going to be. Wow, my glorious husband. You are so handsome and alpha. I haven't seen you be this romantic to me in so long. It's like I can't recognize you anymore. I don't know what have you done on that trip while you weren't home for three days. Why have you forgotten so many things all of a sudden? So as I was saying, Joe threw the ballots that had your name on it and filled the gaps that were missing now that your votes weren't there anymore with ballots that had his name on it that were made out of thin air. That's how he rigged the elections, but I already told you plenty of times that this year, this won't work anymore. We need to find something else. So you're calling this romantic? Dang it, Trump, what have you been doing to this lady? All right, follow me. I bought some seats at this beautiful restaurant that has a view directly to the ocean. I dare you to make me want to throw your ass into it. Don't ruin this night by talking too much. Just sit in that chair, shut up, and be pretty. You know that I'm the best at doing that, but you still didn't tell me what were you doing while you were gone. Were you with Joe playing video games at the White House? 
So what were you exactly doing while not being home for all those days? Listen, I've told you before, I don't like you hanging around Trump too much. You don't have much to learn from him anyways, and he's your political enemy. He might be, but he's handsome, funny, and charismatic. That's my brother for life. Here they are. I knew it. Oh, you piece of shit. Don't you think that you could have escaped me that easily? Come here, idiot, and you bitch. You're cheating on me. Uh, really? What? You really exactly didn't manage to find out that this Look isn't the real me. I am behaving. Barack Obama, your husband. We were gone from home for so long because guess what? Our bodies got swapped. Learn to trust the voices and you Trump. Oh boy, we're going to have a field day. Ah, oh, crap. What are you doing ruining my date? And wait, is that Melania? Oh, you ho. What are you doing with him? You've been cheating on me as well. Only I am able to do that. And... All right, and don't you think that I'm done with you? So you really didn't realize that I am the real Barack Obama. Hear my voice and then hear his as well. What have you told him that you weren't supposed to say? 32 islands from the taxpayer's money, Obama. Really? 32 bro? How many do you need to say? satisfy your needs. And she told me exactly how you guys rigged the elections in 2020. I got it all on tape, buddy. Donald Trump, I've had enough. When you told me that I am not going to forget this night, I wasn't expecting you to mean this. I thought that you changed. And what are you doing with Michelle? Leave her alone and tell your friend Obama to stop shooting me. What was he saying about swapping bodies? Dang it, how many bullets can she take? Watch out, Barack, I got some unfinished business with Melania.